Hello there, we are in the archipelago and we are doing some photography. And uh, I've come to one of my favorite spots on the island that I usually do some photography. I've been posting a lot of pictures from here lately. And I did one thing like I went here in the evening, in the night, and the morning. I got three nice photos from the same thing. And now I'm here, sort of in the middle of the day, I'm trying to do, trying to see what I can do now. Yeah, and this location seems to work quite well also in uh, like the middle of the day. The sun is shining almost at an angle, like directly towards the camera, but not quite, so it creates really nice contrast on the wet rocks. And, and then there's the tree in the, in the background, that's a nice point of interest. One reason why I like this location is because this uh, cliff, which goes into the water, it creates like a really nice diagonal line in the picture. And then there's the tree which grows in a quite strategic point on the cliff. And this tree is of course very typical for this area. So yeah, it tells a lot, of, a lot about the landscape, like symbolic in a way, like uh, since the island has like emerged out of the water after the ice age. And then these windblown trees are very typical, as I said. But I also noticed in the other direction, the light looks really nice also right now. So I'll try to take some pictures there. Yes, I'm trying to find some kind of interesting rock to have in the foreground as a point of interest, but I'm not having so much luck. I'll look, look a bit more closely around. Yeah, I think I found my rock. This one in the water, it creates a nice like half circle and makes the photo much more interesting, I think. And those clouds in the distance, they look really great and they fit perfectly into my picture. Usually it's a very good idea to look around you, not to just go for the photo you have thought beforehand, but look around to see what sort of opportunity you take. I really like this photo that I really unplanned managed to make and the clouds happen to be in the right place and, and the sun created really nice light. Yes, so let's continue and see what we can find. Oh well, seems like we lost the sun now. I had a great composition in mind, but the sun disappeared, so it didn't work. Well, better luck next time, I guess. But I got at least one photo I'm happy with, and maybe even two. I don't know how the picture with the rocks and the trees turned out. I guess we just have to go home to the computer and see what we got. So bye for this time. Bye. <laughs>